day. I hope you're doing fantastic. I know I am because today's Friday. It is actually the Friday that Breanne, my best friend and I, are going to Houston to meet Sarah J. Mass and to get um, the new uh, Throne of Glass series. And so it's, it's gonna be awesome. This weekend's gonna be fantastically amazing and I'm so excited for it. So I thought that today would be a really good day because the time of the month and the time of, of the year and everything like that to do the fall time cozy time tag. And this is an original tag by Sam's Nonsense and I will leave that down below. I just love the fact that cozy's in the name and it just made me, as I was reading it, it made me feel all warm and fuzzy. And this is going to be so much fun to film. And so here are the questions. The first one is crunching leaves. The world is full of color. Choose a book that has reds, oranges, yellows on the cover. So I'm actually going to choose the anomaly. So the anomaly has red and orange and sort of like yellowy vibes all throughout it. And this is sort of, I liked the way that this was um, characterized. It says, if Indiana Jones lived in the X-Files era, he might bear at least a passing resemblance to Nolan Moore, a rogue archaeologist hosting a documentary series derisively dismissed by the real experts but beloved of uh, conspiracy theorists. And so this is very fitting for this time and it had the theme going with it. The next question is cozy sweater. It's finally cold enough to don warm clothing. What book gives you the warm fuzzies? So I'm gonna have to go with the whole entire series that gives me the warm fuzzies anytime I read them. And that is the Magical Cats Mystery Series by Sophie Kelly. I love this series so much. It is just so cozy and magical and I love knowing about Hercules and Owen the kitty cats and it's just super duper cozy. The next one is Fall Storm. The wind is howling and the rain is pounding. Choose your favorite book or genre that you like to read on a stormy day. And so I'm gonna actually have to go with all of the Throne of Glass series by Sarah J. Mass. This is the Assassin's Blade, which is just, uh, it's a novella. It's got tons of stories about all of the characters and um, everything like that. So I thought that it summed it up pretty well. But I just feel like this is the perfect for like a winter storm or like a rainy stormy kind of weather because that's the kind of vibe it gives. Like even the cover gives me that vibe as well. The next one is Cool Crisp Air. What's the coolest character you'd want to trade places with? I'm gonna have to go with Katie Lightfoot from the uh, Magical Bakery Mystery Series because one, she has herb magic, which is fantastic because I feel like that is the best kind of magic to have because you can make all of the herbs and spices and everything, but I also really want her ability to be able to bake because that's cool. I mean, how, how how much more cool could just all the baking be? So yeah, this one right here. The next one is Hot Apple Cider. What underhyped book do you want to see become the next biggest, hottest thing? All Cozy Mysteries. I'm not choosing one. Um, I feel like the genre is underrated and I feel like a whole bunch of people would love it more if they knew that it existed and it was out there and it wasn't considered like a grandma type genre it's not a grandma type genre. It's not. I'm cool and I'm hip and I'm not a grandma. All right, the next one is coat, scarves, and mittens. The weather has turned cold and it's time to cover up. What's the most embarrassing book cover you own that you like to keep hidden in public? Um, I don't get embarrassed by book covers, so I don't, I don't have an answer to this one. There are no embarrassing book covers. Like, I love all of the book covers that I own, so I, 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 don't, I don't have an answer to that one. The next one is pumpkin spice. What are your fall time comfort foods or foods in general? I have been loving having a warmed muffin, whether it's like a apple fritter muffin or blueberry muffin or cinnamon muffin with um, cinnamon spicy tea. That has been my go-to jam lately. It is just so freaking tasty. I, I love it. It's just so good. And last but certainly not least is warm, cozy bonfire. Spread the cozy warmth. Who do you tag? 
I'm gonna tag Nicole from Who Picked This Book, Angela from Writer A Heart, and Bethany from Beautifully Bookish Bethany. I don't know if you guys have already done this tag, but I thought that it would be a really, really fun tag to do, specifically for the fall time, cozy time kind of vibes. So let me know some of your answers to this. Is there a book that you guys are embarrassed by that you don't necessarily want out in public? Let me know down below. That's the end of this chapter of Court Tagonist. Please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. And until next time, guys, happy reading. Bye. Hi, love, love. Oh, goodness. Thank you for being quiet through most of the video. No, don't eat my nose. You want to say bye? Say bye. Say bye.